In this week's Healthy Living, we are focusing on marijuana and infertility in men. Doctors at UW Medical Center have been studying a link between the two, and they are concerned about the negative impact that pot may have on men's reproductive health. It's also well known that tetrahydrocannabinoid, which is the active ingredient, or at least one of the active ingredients in marijuana, is a direct inhibitor of sperm production and of the sperm motility apparatus. So Dr. Walsh says sperm counts are declining, and experts cannot at this point explain why. But as more states legalize recreational marijuana, he says new data on sperm count and pot use will be easier to collect. So the implications of this are important, and as we see marijuana use on the rise, we need to monitor and study it very closely. And it is also important to point out, according to UW's Alcohol and Drug Abuse Institute, marijuana is the most commonly used illicit drug among women of reproductive age and of pregnant women. Now, although all of the risks to the baby are not completely known, experts say THC, that's the active ingredient in pot, can cross the placental barrier and is secreted into the breast milk of nursing mothers. Now, for that reason, doctors strongly suggest that moms who are breastfeeding or who are pregnant or who are trying to become pregnant do not use marijuana. Now, if you would like to see more of our healthy living segments like this one, you can go to q13fox.com slash healthy living.